Next Move Group, the voice of economic development. We have quite a few great projects to highlight this week. Thank you for joining me. I'm Next Move Group COO Ivy Stanley. Element Designs, one of the leading North American manufacturers of custom aluminum frame glass cabinet doors, will relocate its headquarters and manufacturing operations to Fort Mill, South Carolina. The $5 million project is expected to create 100 jobs in York County. Coming in at over 112,000 square feet, this new location will serve as the company's joint headquarters and manufacturing operations. Machine part manufacturer and distributor General Machine and Tool Company Incorporated announced its plans to expand operations at its headquarters in Elizabethton, Tennessee. The $3.7 million project is expected to create 25 jobs and will allow the company to expand and update its equipment, inventory, and manufacturing capabilities to reach a larger customer base across the Southeast. Pfizer announced plans to expand production at its facility in Kalamazoo, Michigan. The $750 million project is expected to create 300 new jobs. Pfizer's 400,000 square foot production facility is a global supplier of sterile injectable, liquid, and semi-solid medicines, as well as active pharmaceutical ingredients producing more than 144 products. Krispy Kreme is expanding its operations complex in Winston-Salem, North Carolina. With a $5.8 million investment that is expected to add a new production line and create 180 jobs over the next four years. Metal products manufacturer and fabricator Commercial Metals Company will establish a micro mill in Berkeley County, West Virginia. This $450 million project is expected to create over 200 new jobs. This new facility will have the capacity to produce 500,000 tons of straight length rebar and a premium spooled rebar. Spooled rebar boasts less waste, increased productivity, and improved safety. Epitome Energy will locate a soybean crushing plant in Grand Forks, North Dakota. The $400 million project will establish a plant capable of processing up to 42 million bushels of soybeans per year into crude degum soybean oil, meal, and hulls, and is expected to create up to 60 jobs. Flybar Incorporated, a premier sporting toy company and manufacturer of the original pogo stick, will establish a distribution operations in Greenwood, South Carolina. The $8 million project is expected to create 36 new jobs. That's all for this week's Rounding the Bases. As always, please reach out if you have any great project announcements you'd like us to feature on our newscast. I'm always available at ivy at nextmovegroup.com. Due to various demands on time and resources, economic development and trade and export agencies often struggle to complete effective market research and business outreach campaigns. For the past 10 plus years, Research FDI, along with our affiliated consulting groups at Research B2B and FDI 365, have leveraged our in-house knowledge, resources, and expertise in market research and consulting to help over 250 organizations directly facilitate inward investment attraction and new trade and export opportunities for their regions across a wide variety of industry sectors. Our highly personalized services and best cost to quality ratio in the industry ensures our client satisfaction, leading to repeat customers year after year. What are you waiting for? Leave the market research and business outreach to the expert team at Research FDI. To learn more about our services, contact us today.